Wow, this is clean. This is Corey Funk from Mercedes-Benz of Draper. So he offers us all these cars we have on the channel. So shout out to Mercedes-Benz of Draper on Corey Funk. All right, let's talk about the GT63S. So it's got the, the twin turbo V8, uh, 630 horsepower on the S. One of the most fun four-door sedans that I've ever driven. They are going to the you know electric or mild hybrid with the 48 volt battery system as well. Um, the next GT63 we're gonna see is the E-Performance that everybody's all excited about. And for okay. good reason, it's gonna be 805 horsepower plug-in hybrid it's gonna be a monster it's this engine with that electric motor so is it gonna sound the same because i think that's one uh, of the questions i get how does it sound in the v8 it's still gonna sound really good the new c43 with the four cylinder and the 63 there's been some concern and question there but um it still sounds good it's an engine we've had a couple 63s but not the 63s and this will probably be the last one we get before we get the performance card so what color is this it's actually called china blue okay and yeah that's the only other car i've seen it on uh, uh, plus the deep white interior i've never seen another one like it i think it's a yeah. really pretty color combination Tell us about the brakes on this car. So those are the uh, high performance brakes. It's not the carbon ceramics. As you can see, you can get uh, yellow or red. Uh, carbon ceramics are another $10,000 option and not everybody needs them or wants them. So okay. yeah, these are the uh, high performance. And can you get the red brake calipers? You can, but you want the yellow ones. <laughs> it's the better brakes. And what's the price on this GT63S? Uh, just over 209,000 in most expensive factory you've ever seen. Let's talk about the exterior. The night package, uh, you can see flax out around the windows, the mirrors, the front and rear diffuser, but on this one it has the carbon fiber package. So you've got the carbon fiber mirror housing. Carbon fiber mirror housings and, and uh, the aerodynamics package you get fixed wing spoiler with the, the carbon fiber. So depending on uh, what angle it's at, uh, about 225 pounds of downforce on the rear end. Okay. But if you're taking it to the track, loosen it up and manually raise it the standard is the active arrow wing which you're probably used to seeing it's just flat and okay. depending on speed it, it goes higher the faster you go okay so, and this see. one has the night package so all the high gloss black right. elements down here right. on the exhaust diffuser, exhaust tips okay you can get the badges uh, in the dark but we didn't get it on this one yeah. Glass roof. Yeah, that's a that's a massive roof. Multi beam headlights. Closest thing to day daylight there are. Let's talk about the front diffuser here. These these open up, right? Right, and that's for cooling. And then okay. you have the intercoolers on each side. You notice they have the grills. Uh, before they were taking rocks at 150 miles an hour puncture in the intercoolers, so they did a, a warranty update to that and okay. helped out a lot. That's the E63s. It looks, it has a good front. The Panamericana grille. Ground view camera, it's got everything. Wow, it looks dope. Power domes on the hood, as you can see right here.
I'll give you guys an additional walk around. How aggressive is that? 